we're going to make um, some signs. So if I have my two vanishing points and let's say I have a street coming down this way. Oops, slipped a little. I want to put a street sign. Um, so the first thing I would do is make a vertical line. And uh, maybe I make that a double vertical line because I want it to look three dimensional. Okay. And I could make the bottom like a post. So then I would go up to the left and up to the right just a little bit. And then I need to make a third line. So I have an actual post here. Oops. Um, if I was making something like an, uh, a stop sign, I would do um, I would do a box first and then turn it into an octagon. So for the two sides, I would still have the sides be vertical and then I just have to decide like which way it's facing um, go this way so I'm gonna go towards the left vanishing point okay. and then I simply would change the shape of this so I cut off the corners to make an octagon. Basically just slice, 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 and then erase all those corners. So I have the right shape. And then if I want to put the letters in there, I would use my left vanishing point to kind of give myself a guide. Okay. My letters would go along that guide. T. Okay. Um, if I wanted to do a street sign that maybe has more than one thing the crisscrossing like you would have on the corner of a residential street. See, I'll do that down a little lower just so I have more space. I'll put it right in the middle of the road just for fun. Okay, so I have a vertical. <clears throat> and this one, instead of doing a post, I'm just going to do um, like a cylinder. So it's rounded at the bottom, a little easier. And maybe I'll just make it rounded at the top too. Actually, I could see down because it's below. I could see. Um, then I wanted to do a sign that goes in one direction. Use my right vanishing point to make the top and the bottom of that sign. Okay. And it's really important that the right and the left side still stay nice. And vertical okay so maybe that is going in front of this post and then I could do another one going in the other direction and maybe this one's going behind everything else use my left vanishing point And then making sure that stays straight up and down for the left and on the right side of the sign. Okay, that gives you kind of a, you know, the street is this way and the street is this way. So a couple of different ways to make signs. You can also use these posts to put, you know, some sort of like a street lamp on top or I could make a box it's boxier street lamp 
I could make several of these. They would be getting smaller as we get further back. 